A woman in Davidson County is demanding answers after her daughter came home from a basketball game with a swollen eye. Good evening. This is the Fox 8 5 o'clock news. I'm Neil McNeil. I'm Katie Nordine. The Stokes County Sheriff's Office says it is investigating an assault at South Stokes High School that left both the Thomasville High School student and a chaperone hurt. This all happened as they were leaving the basketball game Friday night and Fox 8 Celeste Smith joins us now live. So Celeste, what do we know about the investigation? Well, while the investigators are looking into the assault at South Stokes High School, Thomasville City School said that both the student and staff member are from Thomasville High School. And today I spoke with a mother of the student and she said she wants to know why is nobody facing charges? I want justice. I just don't want no other child to have to go through that. It was a packed basketball game. The stands were full of spectators, including Lucille Royal's 14 year old daughter. The teen wanted to support her fellow Bulldogs as Thomasville took on South Stokes High School in the NCHSAA men's basketball playoffs. Girls got a call from another student who said her daughter and a chaperoning teacher had allegedly been assaulted by a man when trying to leave after the game. He um, tried to like push them back in the door. Um, with that being said, he um, slammed a chaperone, which is a teacher at Thomasville High School's hand, um, and he also um, pushed my daughter and punched her in the face. She says she immediately noticed her daughter's eye was swollen when she came home. She said she met with Thomasville High School administrators about the incident. In a statement about the incident, Thomasville High School said it was aware of the incident, and both our student and staff members sought medical attention due to their injuries as a result of the assault. While the investigation in Stokes County is still ongoing, we're committed to maintaining open lines of communication with their school and all law enforcement officials. Royal said she was told there was surveillance video of the incident and wants to see it. Stokes County Schools also provided a statement confirming the altercation, saying Stokes County Schools is assisting in this investigation and will provide such resources as may be required to support this investigation. No one has been arrested or charged yet. Royals wants justice for her daughter. I'm looking forward to pressing charges. And when asked if there was surveillance video of the incident, Stokes County Sheriff's Office said that they're utilizing all tools that they have for this investigation. Live in Thomasville, Celeste Smith, Fox 8 News. All right.